Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tutorials. And in this What Is Wednesday, we're going to be talking all about what is Remix. So Remix is the full stack React framework that allows you to build really amazing websites using web fundamentals. And the way it ends up working is that you write React code, right? If you've written React code before, this should all look very familiar. You write React code. Remix kind of figures out the rest. It figures out routing. It allows you to have functions for data loading on the server side. You don't ever necessarily have to think about hydration with components. Now, hydration is when you have some information coming from the server side and some JavaScript on the client side. How do those two things reconcile? That's the hydration process. That's not something that you really have to think about with a Remix. And as somebody who really loves full stack server-side rendered frameworks and have done quite a bit of work in them myself, this one definitely gets it right because you don't have to think about it. As it says, Remix is a seamless server and browser runtime that provides snappy page loads and instant transitions by leveraging distributed systems and native browser features instead of chunky or clunky static builds. So again, this is not a static site generator. This is a server-first platform. And again, it's built on the Fetch API, which is awesome because who doesn't love the Fetch API? And this can be deployed on things like Cloudflare workers or serverless functions with Vercel or Netlify or any of that stuff. And it's really, really great. So if you are using something like Next.js or Gatsby or, or even um, Astro to build your React sites, I think you should check out Remix because it's a really great option for building awesome, fast sites that can even work very well without JavaScript. In, I mean, how many React sites can you build that don't work well without JavaScript? Just think about that. And what's really neat about them is that there's even a concept of loaders, which is like a server-side only function. This function runs server-side. That means you can hit things, get data from it, or even query your database from this loader function. In addition, there's also actions, which are basically post requests. So they're like a server-side post route for post, put, delete, any of that stuff where you have a server-side route that you can hit. And this, this route right here, it, it can be used for forms or, or those types of deals. But either way, you can interact with that directly in the same file that you're writing in your UI code. And this is all ends up being file system based routing, as in we have routes, a routes folder, and that routes folder determines the routing structure of our website, just like a lot of other common front end frameworks nowadays. But this again is not just front end frameworks. This is server, uh, server API routes. This is server loader functions. This is post put request routes. It's very, very cool. And this type of thing allows you to work seamlessly with the server and the client again, without even having to think about it. In fact, the only time I think about the server or the client really is when you're dealing with APIs that only exist in the browser. But since this is react, you're not doing a ton of that. And uh, likewise, this entry.client and entry.server are two entry files. But to be honest, these are not really files that I, these aren't files that I hit really. These are just files that exist. <laughs> so these things exist that to show you that there is a hydrate function on the client, whatever, but we're not having to worry about hydration within Remix, which is one of the reasons why I love it so much. So if you want to check out a server side based platform that allows you to deploy just about anywhere, as long as you can deploy a node app or, or serverless functions. Again, this thing is really, really neat. I highly recommend checking out Remix at remix.run. Uh, this used to be a paid project. So in case you're still coming at it from that perspective, this is now a, a free open source project. You can uh, just get started. Do one of these quick starts or you can take the tutorial series at leveluptutorials.com. That's right, we have a remix for everyone tutorial series at leveluptutorials.com. If this type of thing seems like something that you're interested in learning, and I honestly highly recommend learning it from anywhere, not just from Level Up Tutorials, then check it out on leveluptutorials.com. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.